Hello, welcome to another video from Midas Touch Toys, Games and Collectibles. And today we're looking at the 2006 release, buy character options from their Doctor Who series of action figures and play sets. Um, with this particular set being of the 10th Doctor and the remote control canine. Okay, so this is the box that they come in. Um, this is a box is still sealed, has, is unopened. Um, and it says on the box, Doctor Who, the Doctor and RC K9. Um, and it's got featuring motorized K9 movement, poseable the Doctor figure, K9 speech and sound effects, remote control handset with dual stick control, and affirmative master, it says underneath there. Okay, before we have a zoom in and a closer look, let's turn the box around and see what it says on the back. Okay, so this is the back of the box, and I've spun it round. Um, and it says Doctor Who featuring K motorized canine movement, poseable the Doctor figure, canine speech and sound effects, remote control handset and dual stick control, same, pretty much the same as what it's uh, featured on the front. And it's got images taken from the episode School Reunion, you can see here, here and here, and here, and there's a picture of the police box there. Um, and all down the bottom is all the, inf the copyright information. Uh, it says up here, it says K9 is a mobile computer in the shape of a dog uh, constructed by Professor Marinus of a medical foundation to be a companion for him whilst in deep space. K9 is both a huge database and has defense capabilities being equipped with a retractable laser in the nose which can be set to stun or kill. He can integrate with virtually any computer system including the TARDIS, and has been responsible for getting the Doctor out of many a tricky and dangerous situation. K9 travelled with the fourth Doctor in the TARDIS on many adventures and became a favourite companion. At some point, a newer version of K9 was constructed by the Doctor and left on Earth with Sarah Jane Smith, a young journalist who had travelled on adventures with the third and fourth Doctors. This K9 had many adventures with Sarah on Earth and in space. Eventually, he shuts down, having become worn out and obsolete, and is eventually reactivated when the 10th Doctor returns to Earth. Okay, so that's the um, back of the box. Let's just turn to the side and see what's on the side. Okay, well, that's the side of the box. That's a pretty good view, actually, of the Doctor action figure, um, the remote control canine and the handset. And it says again, motorized canine movement, canine speech and sound effects, remote control control unit with canine styling, uh, control unit features, dual stick movement, control and button activated canine speech and gun sound. Okay, let's go back to the front of the box and we zoom in. Okay, so as this box is still sealed and unopened, I don't particularly want to open the box and take the items out. So um, I've zoomed in so you can see K9 in his weathered state. Um, this was before the doctor reconstructed him. Um, so this is how um, the 10th doctor found K9 uh, with Sarah Jane Smith in the episode school reunion. Um, okay, so K9 is about um, four, five inches wide and stands probably about four inches tall. Um, he's on motorized wheels, as you know, um, and operated by the remote control handset, which is just below there. That's the remote control handset there. And obviously he comes with the 10th Doctor action figure, the five inch figure, um, dressed in his pinstripe suit as he was in the episode School Reunion. Um, that's basically it, basically it really. So these were released in 2006. They were the first, amongst the first releases um, by character options. Um, as you can see, if we zoom out, you can see from the packaging, it's the very first series of um, figure, figure range that come in the orange packaging. Um, as I say, they're, they're quite difficult to find now, especially in this unopened condition um, and highly sought after. But, as usual, we at Midas Touch have managed to find a few, which are currently available for you on the Midas Touch website, which you can get to very simply by clicking the link below. It will take you straight to the website where you'll be able to find these and many other vintage Doctor Who items, and many other vintage toys, games and collectibles come to that. There's over 10,000 products currently available on the website for you to view and purchase at your leisure. 
And also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button because we're uploading videos for every new item that goes into the website. There will be something for everybody. And I'm sure you won't want to miss that. So I hope you've enjoyed this very short video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.